Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Sanforia, and today I'm an angel. Ooh, look at my halo. It's so cute. Um, this is the first episode in a new series that I'm going to be doing, which is uh, a little bit more complicated than the other ones because I'm going to be playing Feed the Beast. Ah, I'm so scared because I am just yeah i've been looking at some videos and it looks some of the power stuff looks so complicated so um we're gonna have lots of fun trying to figure out how to do that um also i don't know if you can tell but i'm actually quite ill at the moment um this is the first video i've recorded in a couple of days because i've not been feeling very well um so hopefully we can we can do this but i've been so looking forward to filming this because i've been working really hard getting some stuff ready to show you guys but i just had to come on and do it uh, so as you can see, what I did was I landed in spawn when I spawned in. Uh, I'm actually on the Northcraft server. Um, I had to apply to be on it because it's whitelisted, but I'll put the link to their website in the description if anybody else wants to try and apply and get in. So um, yeah, so I applied and they accepted me. Whoop! So I landed in spawn. I went to the west, went through the west. It was like a west portal to send you like further west. And then you keep going until you're out of that spawn area and then you just kind of keep going and then build where you want. So I came here because I saw all these big trees. Now all, this one and all the pink trees weren't here. Um, I died a couple of times and didn't set this as my home. So as I was walking back, I actually found these pink trees. So I brought all the saplings back and planted them. And I think they look so cute. Um, I like this area because it's very full of flowers and I really want to look into the botanius stuff because um, I just think, look, Look how cute it is. Do -do -do -do. It's all magical. Um, so yes, yeah, so I planted all these pink trees everywhere because my house, which is like over there, my little cabin in the woods, is made out of these trees. So I wanted loads and then I thought they looked gorgeous, so I've kept them. So what I did was down here I created our first little farm. Um, and I also was able to capture some pigs. Uh, this is probably going to be changed because it's just a waste of fences having it all like higgledy piggledy. Um, but I am, there are so many animals around here that it was really easy to just kind of push them in. <laughs> so we've got some lovely pigs in there. Um, and then this is something that I will come and show you in a moment. But I'll show you the house. So this is my little cabin in the woods. It's surrounded by our lovely trees. I think it looks so cute. Um, I had to put a little water source out there. So I'll just show you the house. So at the moment we have this one room that has kind of higgledy piggledy chests in with seeds and food and all sorts of bits that we found. Um, this is our like little tinker's chest. Well, not tinker's chest, sorry. Um, kind of like just the feed the beast stuff. The stuff that I don't know what it is, it's in here. Um, so some of it is um, thumbcraft, which is what something I really want to get into. Um, engineering sticks, blah blah blah, and then these are um, I was playing for ages, and I kept seeing all these beehives. So I um, destroyed one, and it was a Pam's Harvest one, so we got a queen bee. And then I destroyed another, but I had to use a scoop, so I made a scoop, which was really easy. It was just sticks and wool, um, so I made a scoop, and then I destroyed one of the forest honeycomb, uh, one of the forest apiaries, which was like a ready orangey color, and it gave me. Um, this is from Forestry for Minecraft and it gave me a princess and a drone and a honeycomb and I have been watching um, somebody else's video who's been doing a lot of this um, if any of you have watched Silent Lilac's videos um, she's really good and that's who I've actually been watching to try and learn some of this stuff um, and they've been doing a lot of this but I know I need like power and stuff to power the all this other crazy stuff to do with the hive so I've not done that yet um, and then we've just got a little bedroom and then if we go down here we have i just mine this out so we have a little bit of a mine shaft um and then if we come into here i actually mined all the way down to like a little cave system so i've just put a door on there so nothing can get up not that anything was there but just in case and then we can um go and investigate that a bit further so what we're going to do today is um, we need to kind of get started doing some Tinker's Construct stuff so that we can make some really good tools to go mining and things. So that's what that little hut is outside, if I ever get to the top of these stairs because they're so long. Um, that little hut out here. Oh, I'm hungry. 
Let's eat some apples. Apples, apples, apples. It's really a good thing with having all these trees. I planted loads of oak trees as well, so we get quite a lot of stuff. Because we've got Pam's Harvest as well, which is nice. So in here, I just made a little area for all our Tinker's stuff. So this is like my Tinker's shed, in effect. So I've got a little crafting table. I've got all the tool stations, stencil table, patterns, chest, blah, blah, blah. And then I've got this area dug out for the actual smeltery that we're going to need. So um, just before this video, I've been and collected loads of gravel and loads of uh, a little of sand and clay. That's what I needed. And um, so we've got loads of seared bricks. And as you can see, I've already started making a couple. So we'll make a few more. Oops, not like that. Remember how we do? Oop. We need quite a few of these, so we're going to have to go out and collect some more stuff. But we'll go and put these in. Uh, I think this one I <laughs> cover the bottom, though. I forgot how many we needed. It actually takes loads. So we'll put these oh, along the bottom. And then we have these, like, here like this. And then they'll just keep going around. And we need, like, control panels and stuff. But uh, we're going to need more seared bricks for that. So the other thing that I wanted to do this episode was set up... A bit more of a, like a botania garden um, because I have all these fabulous plants which are just amazing and I know nothing about them so like mystical light blue flowers uh, lime flowers blue flowers white flowers yellow flowers that's from by are these yeah the other ones are from biomes of plenty uh, okay let's put the blackberry bushes out as well uh, that's a mystical flower, that's a mystical flower, that's a mystical flower, that's a mystical flower. So, uh, oh, there's a raspberry bush. So we'll go and put these raspberry bushes out so that we can start having some raspberries and some blackberries. Yeah, so we can go and put these out. Um, I don't know where I want them. Should we just put them here? Uh, really? Yeah. It doesn't matter too much. Sorry if also um, we have a bit of lag or anything. Um, because um, when I was looking at this thing, obviously it has like a hundred and something mods in it. Um, so even though at the moment this this like at most I think I've ever been on them, there's been the most has been like five people online at the same time, but um because it is there's so many mods and stuff we do get some lag which is annoying but you know it's fine it's not that we can't deal with it um so yes yeah, so there's our lovely raspberry bushes and our blackberry bushes so they can get building for us we do need to make some more pens for more animals there's loads of cows and sheep and everything we definitely want sheep um the other thing i made oh, i'm getting a bit off topic here but i have to show you this was I went searching around for purple trees because I know there are purple trees and I couldn't find any. Um, luckily, yeah, we have on this one, we have um, slash home. So as long as you've set your home, um, I kind of just go walking as far as I want. And then if anything happens or I need to get back, I can just slash back home, which is kind of cheeky, but I don't mind. So what I did was I actually found like a meadow place, which kind of looks like this, but um, less grassy because this is really grassy it's been quite hard trying to get rid of all of it actually and it had clover so i could make myself a flower band um obviously i already have a flower crown on i kind of have two because on the back i have a pink and a white one but um i wanted a third one why not i'm a fairy i can do what i like so yes yeah, so i made a flower crown it offers nothing it just looks cool and you can get you can have like other flowers into it so this is made using clovers and you can use the flowers to make it different colors but I couldn't find any of those flowers. So, just before it goes dark, we're going to plant these because um, I want them planted rather than just, like, in my inventory because they're not, they're not going to do anything in there. So we might as well plant them around um, so we can actually kind of see what, what they're doing because I have no idea what they are and I have no idea what they do. Um, so, oh, there's quite, <laughs> this is like the Batania bit, I think, because, uh, yeah, I kind of have put them all in there, which doesn't look great right now, but, um, I, I don't know if I want, like, a, I think I'm going to put, like, a little path off, 
somewhere like down there maybe and have all the plants in there for Britannia maybe with like a fence around so that it's all protected I've got a few of them outside my house just because I like these ones because they're pink and purple and lilac and all lovely and sparkly but yeah so that's where I'm actually going to leave this video today um i hope you've enjoyed it um i can't wait to go and get more resources so we can actually do some stuff but i just wanted to show you guys what i've been up to um and what's going to be happening with this new series so i hope you really enjoyed it and i will see you all soon so bye guys